Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to go over a quick tip in Excel that has to do with merging and centering cells. So for these, we have the merge and centered. You can merge and center by just highlighting an area and clicking in the alignment tab, merge and center. But the problem with merging and centering is that if you want to sum all of the sales and you're dragging down, and you can see down here in the bottom, that the sum is 45, but say you want to sum all of these, whenever you get down to the next merged and center, it selects the whole entire selection, you know, column count of the merge and center. So it won't matter for the top row, but for these, you can just click and unmerge and center them. And then we can actually just click control to grab multiple selections of cells. Instead of merging and centering, if we right click and format cells, go to center across selection. So this is essentially making it look like it's merged in center, but you can grab each individual cell. So now if we want to do a total, you can click alt equals, and now it will be the total from everything in all of these rows. And the sum there you can see in the bottom is 171. Same thing for this. Alt equals, and then that gives a total for all of these. So that is a quick way to just be able to drag down instead of getting stuck with multiple columns in your selection. So it makes it easier to navigate. So that's a short tutorial. Uh, please like, subscribe, comment if you want to see anything else or if you're having trouble with anything on Excel. Also make content for SQL, ClipChamp, Word, PowerPoint, and just give tips and tricks and some easier way of doing things. Thanks for watching.